Good morning. It's Sunday, and it's going to be a nice, warm afternoon ahead of us. Take advantage of now because, you know, we're in the 60s in a lot of spots in the valley. I do think today we'll be in the mid to upper 90s across Marysville, Sacramento, probably a high of about 97 degrees, 95 in Modesto, about 93 in Fairfield, low to mid 90s as you head up into the foothills, about 92 in and around Auburn this afternoon. We should be in the upper 70s later today, up around Tahoe, less wind than yesterday, plenty of sunshine. So, overall, a good looking day. Tomorrow could be even hotter. We'll check out that forecast coming up in the next hour. I've dabbled in a little bit of it, the <laughs> yoga thing, but I've never kind of really grasped yeah. around it. But tomorrow might be the day, if you're like me, to take the plunge, take a class because. Yeah, it's free <laughs> uh, tomorrow. And this is a great way to continue to have a Labor Day stress free kind of holiday, right? Yoga studios across our area taking part in the Sacramento free day of yoga on Labor Day, focusing on whole body here, which includes the idea that food plays a very big role in achieving that balance. Joining us this morning is Michelle Marlahan, founder of Sacramento Free Day of Yoga, and Jess Rhodes, host of Eating an Ayurveda Taste Explosion. Thank you so much to both of you for being with us. Okay, let's start with what is Ayurveda, and am I saying that correctly? Yeah, we're <laughs> saying it just perfectly. Ayurveda is the science of life. It's a sister science to yoga. So essentially, we're working with foods and spices and oils on the body in order to heal yourself and de-stress as well. So instead of just those poses that may be a little bit stressful, we can work from food as well. So you're saying food, what's in it, and even drink, you can feel differently by the end of the day if you're drinking it or, or eating it. Exactly. Do you want to start with some, some infused water here and tell us what we're drinking and why it'll make us feel different? So I want to imagine it's a hot day. It's Labor Day. Okay, we're imagining. Oh, I can imagine. We're there. <laughs> and maybe something happens is a little stressful, and you want to come home and you probably crave maybe a beer or a glass of wine and some hot, some like potatoes, something maybe. hot. Maybe. Let's maybe. Say. <laughs> and mostly what we crave is actually increasing the heat. So we end up more stressed by the time we go to bed and we wake up even more lethargic and tired. And even exhausted. like ice cream. Even ice cream. Oh. Pastries. <laughs> Which Sorry. are wonderful Trying. things, but they're heating. So okay. we're going to try some infused water, and the first one is a ginger infused water. Okay. And do you have a guess whether it's heating or cooling? You've probably had ginger before. Uh, heating. Yeah. Heating. Go ahead and try. Yeah. Here. Oh. Okay. This one is the ginger. Yeah, and maybe you can taste the warming start to happen in the skin. Oh of your yeah. Mouth. Ooh, absolutely. You're right. Spicy. Spicy. Mm -hmm. Okay. And so that'd be really good for indigestion, or if you're feeling isolated, or like depression sits in, you really want to warm up your body to have some of that life come back in. Oh, oh interesting. Very nice. And the next okay. one is hibiscus mint lemon. Okay. okay. And so maybe you can taste the difference between ginger, how that's a little cooling. Very cooling. In your mouth. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Refreshing. So this would be a great drink to have at your Labor Day barbecue. Oh, Just hibiscus throw some and hibiscus mint. and some mint and lemon. It literally took me 30 seconds to mm -hmm. throw all that stuff oh, in great there. idea. Okay, uh, now that we have definitely started off our holiday with a little bit of drink, let's get some eating <laughs> in there now. So I also made a rice dish because rice is such a common thing for us to, for us to all make at home. Mm -hmm. So this is the rice plain, and what I've done is made a heating version and a cooling version. So oh, okay. there's. The first one we'll try is the cooling. It's the lighter one. It's generally how you can tell something's more cooling. So what's in here? It's cilantro coconut um, with some celery inside mm. of it. So Ooh, that's the, good. The celery is really like cools. Mm -hmm. This can be a really great Labor Day treat as well when it's warm. Something to make your belly calm, and then you can have another, you know, glass of. A little bit of want. crunch in there as well. Mm -hmm. And what's this next one? The next one is a tahini basil curry. Mm. So that one. The warming is is sensitive, so after you eat it, you'll start to feel warm on the sides of your mouth. That one will also warm up your belly, working against the isolating or the indigestion. Wow, issues. very nice. I'll definitely take a part in the uh, eating part of it. <laughs> Yoga, it was really tough for me. I've tried it a couple of times, but this is a good way for people to go out who are staying veteran yogis, but for those first timers as well, maybe those who are a little bit more intimidated to come out Absolutely. because it's free and it's happening all across our area. 20 studios all over Sacramento and it is great for the seasoned yogi, but it's also great for those who have never done it before. At It's All Yoga tomorrow we have a class called I'm New to Yoga, Please Don't Hurt Me. <laughs> I'm not bendy yet, please yeah. don't hurt me. Exactly. <laughs> and then we have, have mercy, <laughs> uncle, uncle. You're right. And then we have the yoga food. Um, we're even doing the yoga of skin. There's a beauty bar that's happening at um, one of the, the studios. So 
There's Yoga's a lot going really taken right off uh, in the Sacramento it area. Is. This is the third time you guys are putting this on. How excited this is are you to be annual. able to offer this to people, especially on at a time when people are supposed to take off, do a little stress relief? Exactly. Yeah, we just we encourage people to studio hop, make a day of it, come out, have fun. Yeah, go very online. nice. We'll have a list of studios that are available online yes. at kcra.com. Absolutely. Great. Thank you to both of you Thank and you for so being much. with us this morning. Maybe we'll see you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Big baby. <laughs>